guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Amanda Jewel, and today I am taking you guys along a productive online school day in my life at the University of Texas at Austin, and I hope you all enjoy. Welcome back to the day in my life at UT Austin, except it's in Dallas because school is online because coronavirus. <laughs> My glass of water. outside to eat breakfast. I've genuinely never eaten breakfast right here on the concrete on the patio. Don't know really what's going through my mind, but I finished my 8 a.m. class. I have a podcast today. I'm so excited to finally get to sit down with my friend Nikki Page. She's an amazing content creator and she's also the influencer relations for a lot of brands that I know, so we love her. Set me in the corner now and take me colors of bed, won't you hear me I love my new lights, so I'll link them down below for you guys. And this is the stuff that I got yesterday at the Dallas Farmer's Market, and I'm obsessed with the new Boutique that I found. I got a bunch of staple items, and I'm really pumped about their basics. Like, this is so cute. This is the softest material you've ever felt in your entire life, and I'm obsessed with the earrings. Okay, to just wake up my face, I'm going to use this beauty water. It's my favorite skin product that I own because it's a toner, a moisturizer, a makeup remover, an exfoliant, a moisturizer, all in one. So I have my podcast in like 15 minutes. So I'm just going to try to get fast, get ready fast, <laughs> get fast ready. My biotin. I need to buy a new Glossier skin tint. If you guys have any recommendations for like light coverage, BB creams, or I guess foundations, but like I like this because it's light and, you know. Oh, hi, Chico. Hi, doggy. Hi, sister. Okay, I don't think I did my eyebrow right, but we don't have time to care, so. I really just go for the same <laughs> everyday look since like 2012 YouTube, my freaking naked palette. All right, you guys, I am ready for my podcast. I'm obsessed with my outfit right now. So these are my blue light glasses from Soho's Vision. I will have them linked below as always. This is a top from the Dallas Boutique. It's called Shop Kalo. And then these Boohoo bottoms are super stretchy and I love them. Obsessed with my little outfit. And I really wanna wear my new earrings today. So I'm gonna put these on. And then I've gotta run to the office because my podcast starts in one minute. And luckily, I'm friends with Nikki, but I'm chilling actually. I usually get really nervous for podcast episodes. My friend Amanda Watt and I talk about that a lot. It's just like part of the gig, you know what I mean? Oh, I'm obsessed. Now I am ready. Got my podcast microphone, got my adapter, got my computer, and now let's go to the office. Also, my Band-Aid is from getting a flu shot yesterday, so if you have not already gotten your flu shot, you should go get it, protect those around you, and since it's really the only virus we have a vaccine for, take advantage of it. Can I just say hello? Hello. We just recorded hello. a podcast. Yay, <laughs> stream our podcast. I sold a top on my Depop, which you guys should shop at Amanda Saunders. And now I'm just packaging it up for the post office. It was a Free People active shirt, so. I couldn't let you rip it off without I content. I don't wanna rip it off. No, you can rip it off. No. I just, he's gonna rip off my bandaid. You ready? Yeah. On three. One, two. two. Oh, that's so much better than I thought it was going to be, but ow. Let's see, uh, you leave it on there too long, it's going to, uh. Mess up my skin. Yeah. Cute. But it only needs to be on there about 20 minutes anyway. 
the way I literally came over here to my computer with like, what am I supposed to do? Like it's 12.59. Oh, I don't know, Amanda. Maybe log into your classes starts at one. Sorry for the inconvenience. <laughs> So I put on a bib because I don't want to get marinara on my new shirt and I'm air frying rubber. Chef Boyardee made boy. The way that that was just like the worst angle ever. <laughs> what the frick is up you guys? It has been a busy Monday. I feel like I didn't really go to sleep. Like I woke up pretty well rested, but. So I'm currently out running errands right now. I ordered the wrong book for my class. So I am going to return this right now. And then I have some mail I'm mailing out, including my Depop order, as you already know. So I got a TikTok drink. It's a caramel ice macchiato, except instead of caramel, pumpkin spice syrup. So let's give it a taste. Oh, it's great. Oh, it's brilliant, honestly. Never been done before. Truly magnificent. Absolutely show-stopping. I also got a pumpkin cream cheese muffin and so we're gonna try that out wow wow i wish i had water is this real water should i trust it i don't know that was great i already went to the, the ups store so now i'm going to the post office all right it is definitely homework and chill time because i just finished going to the post office and now my errands are done for the day also i am living for this grandma next to me she wore a face mask and gloves and a Clorox wipe, which is literally what I used to go everywhere in. But she wore it into the post office and now she's wiping down all of her mail and she is truly ahead of her time. We should be truly taking notes. That's what I did at the beginning of quarantine. I took things very seriously, but then you realize that you're six months in and you are wearing a mask off the bottom of your floorboard we don't know honestly i'm just freaking talking at this point talking 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 I'm gonna get like a thumbnail of me with my coffee because didn't pay five dollars for this for nothing all right i really want to write a blog post too The way I've literally been writing a blog post on the back of my grandpa's car because that is what procrastination looks like. I've been putting this off so long that I'm like, I'm standing right here until I'm done with this. Okay, so I just made a blog post about strategizing the last three months of 2020 and I'm trying to finish it up, but please go read my blog. I put a lot of effort into all my platforms, theamandajoel.com backslash blog. And also, if you didn't remember, I have an ebook that I also wrote called Becoming an Influencer, and yeah, it can help you learn about influencer marketing, the industry, the future of it, or how you can become an influencer. Take a look around. If you feel overwhelmed, don't worry, I do too. That's why we're gonna clean. <laughs> So, productive tip, put on, I'm gonna put on like a video and then try to clean as fast as the video. So I got these new shirts yesterday from the Dallas Farmer's Market. I also got this one and I'm obsessed. Just ignore that. But anywho, they feel like the material at Urban Outfitters, if you know what I'm talking about, the out from under tight fitted tops. I've also seen other boutiques online have these kind of tops, but I just never bought them because they're kind of pricey. They're like 34 bucks each, which... Is that not a lot? I don't know. But I need to wash them. I'll link the small business down below that sells these. Okay, so actually 20 minutes later, got into a conversation with my grandpa and we started talking about the old days and you know how those go. <laughs> and I'm so freaking grateful for those because we were also talking about how 
I just really appreciate that he grew up with no technology whatsoever in the middle of nowhere on a farm like poor and yet here we are extremely advanced and then there are people younger than me came into the world after there was technology so it's like there are, will one point be a world where all of your ancestors have only known technology and that's cuckoo for cocoa puffs so now i'm gonna clean my room and watch a youtube video cleaning's hard clorox wipe also ignore the rave over there it's like a christmas rave um i don't really know what's going on <laughs> it keeps switching through the most but it's okay so here's my very upscale <laughs> nightstand. I do have one in Austin that I used to have, but anywho. I just have, okay, so I cleaned it off. I have sugar lips, rose quartz facial tool, glossier, a Boss Babe sticker that I literally just put there, more glossier, and then this Biosense pear cream and the Derma E under eye patches. I hope that was interesting. Also, don't forget to watch my how to make a vision board video because I want you to manifest your dream life with me. Ta-da, here are all my crystals. They're looking beautiful, I love them. You guys know I love my electric handle lighter, but like the weight. <gasps> oh my God, where did the ember go? Okay, the way I'm just like gonna burn down their house with the flame. Mom and dad, can you come pick me up? Oh my god, the rave again! What is the... Can that stop? Alright, I don't see a fire yet, so... <laughs> Guys... What would your higher self do? Right now. Literally, I want you to ask yourself that. What would your higher self do right now? Would she clean? Would she get up and do her homework? Would she call her mom? Would she go cook dinner? Would she start writing that book? Buy my ebook. I love you. <laughs> And I want you to go do what your higher self would do, even if you don't feel like it. I'm hanging it right here because I'm really excited to wear it. It's looking great in here now. Oh, and subscribe. And subscribe. Okay, sorry. Dude, I'm loving it. The vibes are set. So now I'm going to take pictures for my blog theimangel.com backslash blog you said it this angle is kind of everything but yeah i'm taking pictures i'm doing a youtube starter pack i actually have some really popular blog posts about how to make a youtube channel and also law of attraction and journaling so those are like my successful niches on my website for sure thanks to pinterest so if you are an aspiring content creator i highly suggest you get on pinterest it's insane the amount of traffic that you can generate from that app um, and if you're not already follow me on pinterest at the amanda jewel i post pins every single day and yeah i don't know you guys like you ever just feel like you're stepping into your higher self like i genuinely feel like today is a monumental new chapter of just my life and i really do think that strategizing i guess it really came from like strategizing how i want to spend the next three months of this year and of course family is my number one priority school is my number one priority and and underneath all of those um i wrote down the goals that are beyond that and i highly suggest you do that too i will link my blog post down below on how to journal to strategize your year okay so i'm going to mark off things that i've done on my to-do list to my 8 a.m class did the podcast with nikki went to spanish i need to do my peer comments i wrote the blog post but i haven't posted it I am vlogging, I have not done Pinterest yet, that'll go with the blog post. TMA, I'm waiting for a caption, portfolio group is at 8, and I need to choose the winner for the giveaway today. And now I am answering brand emails. So right now I am making the Pinterest pins for my blog post, which this is what takes like the longest time, but if you don't do it well your blog post can just 
die off. Do you know what I mean? I'm done. Yay, I'm done. I posted the blog. Posted the Pinterest pins. And so I'm going to click there and then go to the blog post. And here it is. All right, you guys, I'm going to cook Hello Fresh for dinner tonight. Not sponsored. Also, my grandpa froze my veggies, so hopefully they're okay. All right, update from the kitchen. Hello Fresh stresses me out. Like, I understand it's supposed to be easy, but I just get overwhelmed. <laughs> Here's what I have left. How's your dinner? Look at the camera, Joe. What's your dinner, Mom? What? Vibe check! Oh my god, I'm obsessed! Alright, so I've got to do homework. I basically still have my entire drink from earlier, so I'm just gonna drink some of it. Alright guys, so I started some of my homework, but brain a little dead, would rather just do it tomorrow. I'm gonna finish crossing off what I got done today. Okay, it is now 9.42 p.m. and I'm going to take a bath because I'm so tired. Oh my gosh, you guys. So I just put on these pants that feel like a fleece blanket that I got at the Dallas Farmer's Market. They're a little big, but they are so comfortable. I don't even care that they're a little big. And I'm sure I can just wash them and they'll shrink a little bit, um, but... They are going to be the highlight of my fall. Really want the Winky Lux lip balm. And I probably shouldn't buy anything else right now, but by recording myself do it. It's like a little business expense, you know what I mean? <laughs> um, and also, I will link it down below if it turns out good, because I've heard it's really good, so. <laughs> I'm only $22 away from free shipping. <laughs> to do it or to not to do it? Not. What? Why? So I am about to edit this video and what's so cool is my package just came in from Glossier. So I got the perfecting skin tint. Obsessed with this. I got a highlight concentrate and a lid star. I'm so excited to try this. And of course, I sent myself a note that I deserve these things. Okay, so this is a lot smaller than I thought it would be, but it still looks good on. This is supposed to be like herb green, but it kind of just looks like brown. What the hell is that? No offense. So I don't know about this. I don't I don't know if I will be wearing this. <laughs> that is all. Thank you guys so much for watching this productive day in my life. I really hope that you all enjoyed and that it gave you a little bit of motivation to go do your homework or Zoom classes, whatever it may be. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye. Stream my podcast. Buy my ebook. Okay, later. Goodbye.